This is a walkthrough video of 605 Chevy Chase. This is in Whitfield again. This is a crazy house. Um, it has a carport and a garage and a basketball court. Um, no, basketball net. But okay, and it's got lots of spider webs. But um, just real quick, show the garage. Just nothing, one car garage full of junk. Kind of nothing, nothing great. There's the panel, fuse panel. Actually looks okay. Big fuse panel with auxiliary stuff, so. Okay, so this isn't the front door, but this is like the, the, the carport door. We have like a pantry over here. We have a kitchen, okay? Stay with me because this is where it gets really confusing. I'm gonna go right to the confusing bit. Kitchen's okay. Um, as a rental, it would be serviceable. Check out this room. Now, this is where I think you put the bowling alley. I think you have a bowling alley here, but this has gotta be like 40 feet by 20 feet. Oh, there's an airplane going by, by the way. And so it's got a fireplace, and then it's got this crazy, hear the airplane? Doesn't go over very often, but it does. But look at this thing. This is just this huge expanse. It's a nice slight tile, but they didn't complete it. But it's this huge space, a dance hall? I don't know what this is. This is just crazy space. Um, then it's got like this wood oven over here. Um, I don't know how to describe this. This is just crazy, but I'm, I'm going to get back to it. Let me just show you the pool, which is kind of junky and low. I'm probably cracked and it's up on this slab and we see all the neighbors and, um, there's a tree. I don't, know, I don't know the condition of the roof. I'm going to assume probably not so good. But look at this, just weird angles and weird stuff. And then you got like this space here. I don't know. Okay. So coming back to this. And what's that post doing there? Just out of curiosity. Is that, is that just sitting there? No, it's fixed. Of course it is. That's where you attach the volleyball net. Huh, I don't know. Play basketball out here? I don't get it. Anyway, okay, so I'm coming this way. Real quick, I'm just gonna walk you through this because it's absolutely nuts. So I'm still walking this direction, and there's a bedroom. Okay, you say, all right, that's cool. Bedroom, half decent windows, that's nice. Slanty ceiling, dead cockroach, that's okay. Bathroom has kind of been redone. I don't know about that vanity right there, that shelving unit there. But okay, ba a bathroom. And you're like, ooh, look at that pretty terrazzo. Ooh, but that's not so good right there with a little patch job. And then you come in here to this bathroom, you got another bathroom, okay, with another tall vanity, like they just did that. And then you got a bedroom. Okay, I'm gonna start, let's start keep, keep track now. This is the second bedroom I've looked at, and that's where the water heater is. Odd place for it. But okay, I'm with it so far. So we have a bedroom with carpet. And then we come in here. This is another bedroom with a closet. And you know, I, I have to say, I don't really see any roof leaks. I see where they taped the corner and never took the tape down, but okay. This walks out, giant slider. Look at this thing's all one piece and the whole thing slides. It's gotta weigh a ton. Um, I haven't tried opening it. As is this one, look at this, one giant slider, but it does open all up onto this courtyard. This is where the AC is, and I have to say, look at that date, 02. So it's not ancient, it's not that bad. Um, this is really crummy floating laminate floor that was put down, and um, whack job tile in the kitchen. Back to that patio. And here we've had some issues. I think we've had some issues up here. What do you think? What does that look like? Does that look like issues to you? Like issues to me. Anyway. Okay, so now that was three bedrooms so far, right? So now we have this room with another fuse panel. Huh. For like this wing of the house? I don't know. 
Um, okay. And another bathroom. That, would, that makes... I think this is the third bathroom that I've seen. All the new vanities. They must have been in the vanity business. And then we have another bedroom with a bunch of shelving units, which I don't know where those went. So I guess, okay, so that's four bedrooms, four bedrooms, three baths, a weird room. Maybe I guess it's laundry room. I guess this is the pantry room. We got a garage out there, we got a carport. And, um, and then this just crazy space. So anyway, I'm Jules Roman, Yorkshire International. 941-366-0000. Thanks for watching.